Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Somesh. In this video, I am going to explain very interesting shortcuts in trigonometry. Computing the trigonometric ratios of twice the angle. For example, just observe these figures. Suppose small a comma small b comma small c are the triplets of a triangle when theta is given. So small x, small y, small z are the triplets of the triangle when 2 theta is given. What is the relation between a comma b comma c and x comma y comma z? That is the simple trick. So x is equal to 2ab y is equal to b square minus a square z is equal to c square so these are the triplets of the triangle suppose i will explain this logic with one example suppose sin theta is equal to 3 by 5 so sin theta is equal to 3 by 5 obviously this is equal to 3 small a is equal to 3 small c is equal to 5 so small b obviously it becomes 4 so a is equal to 3 b is equal to 4 c is equal to 5 so what is the value of x x is equal to 2ab 2 into 3 into 4 that is equal to 24 and y is equal to b square minus c square so 4 square minus 3 square that is equal to 7 z is equal to c square that is equal to 25 so new triangle triplets are 24 comma 7 comma 25 so how to calculate how to find tan 2 theta tan 2 theta is equal to simply 24 by 7 without any formula you can compute like Suppose cosec 2 theta, cosec 2 theta is equal to 25 by 24, 25 by 24. A simple shortcut is, seems to be like that. If A comma B comma C are the triplets of a triangle when theta is given, the new triplets when theta is equal, when angle is equal to 2 theta, the new triplets are 2ab, b square minus a square, c square. So, based on this logic, we can compute the values. Sin, sin 2 theta, cosec 2 theta, cot 2 theta, whatever it may be. Okay. Similarly, next logic, compute the trigonometric ratios of, of the angle. So, so these are the figures small a comma small b comma small c are the triplets of the triangle when theta is given the new triplets when theta by 2 x y z so what is the relation between x y z and a b c so x is equal to a okay y is equal to b plus c z is equal to square root of b plus c whole square plus a square i will explain with one example for example sin theta is equal to 5 by 30 sin theta is equal to 5 by 30 obviously this side becomes the 12 so that means small a is equal to 5 small b is equal to 12 small c is equal to 30 so what is the value of tan theta by 2 in traditional method we have to find sin theta and cos theta tan theta by 2 is equal to sin theta by 1 plus cos theta like but in this method just x is equal to a so that is equal to 5 y is equal to b plus c that is equal to 12 plus 13 25 z is equal to square root of b plus c whole square 
that means 25 square plus a square 5 square that is equal to square root of 650 so the new triangle seems to be like that 5 25 square root of 650 so tan theta by 2 tan theta by 2 is equal to 5 by 25 that is equal to 1 by 5 suppose cosec 2 the cosec theta by 2 is equal to square root of 650 by 5 like that you can compute any value so the simple logic is if a comma small a comma small b comma small c are the triplets of a triangle when theta is given the angle becomes the theta by 2 the new triplets are a comma b plus c comma square root of b plus c whole square plus a square these are the new triplets so if angle becomes theta by 2 simple loss okay this is this is a this is b plus c this is square root of b plus c whole square plus a square so you can compute the any value okay similarly for double angles so x becomes 2ab is the one side and this side is b square minus a square and hypotenuse is equal to c square so you can compute any value tan 2 theta cosec 2 theta cot 2 theta by using simple logic without formulas you can compute the values thank you